Hey, this is Samantha here from RecipeThis.com and the voice behind the popular kitchen gadgets podcast, Magic with Gadgets. Today I wanted to show you how easy it is to cook air fryer chicken Kievs. I grew up in Northern England and it was all about the chicken Kievs and they are so easy to make in the air fryer. You will absolutely love this recipe. And we also have 450 plus more easy air fry recipes over at RecipeThis.com as well as a fantastic air fryer mini course which is free and our free air fry newsletter. I recommend you check it out and if you have any questions or comments you can reach out to us or just comment on this video. So chicken Kievs, oh my god I just love the garlic butter in them. So let's open up a box. The box I've got um, is some Waitrose ones. Let's see what they're like, shall we? So, they're of the typical chicken Kiev size, so if you've got a different brand of chicken Kievs, just rest assured you can use the same recipe. Or if you've made some ahead and they're in your freezer, then you can also use those. So. Place two chicken kievs in your air fry basket. There's no need to spray them because I find they go crispy enough on their own, but you can also check a couple of minutes before the cook time is over. And place them in your air fryer. So now it's time to set the temperature and the time. I recommend a cook time of 20 minutes and then setting the temperature to 180 Celsius, 360 Fahrenheit. Note that if you're using an air fryer oven, they're a little bit slower than an air fryer basket, so you can check on them at 20 minutes and then maybe give them three or four more minutes if they need it. So then just press that. And we've baked, let's check on our chicken Kievs. Oh wow, now, if you take a look, you can see just how golden they are. So as you can understand, you can see now why I haven't added extra virgin olive oil spray to them. Because it's just one of those foods that doesn't really need them. But I'll tell you one thing. In between putting them in the air fryer and taking them out, our smoke alarm has gone off. Um, we find that chicken Kievs are quite smoky. We often get questions asking, uh, why does my air fry smoke so much, well this is a key example of a recipe that does this. But they taste so good, so our cat might not forgive us for all the noise, but they just still taste amazing. So let's check on them, shall we? So they are just so easy to handle. And so delicious, let me show you them closely. And you can just load them onto your plate. You know, from my childhood, it was always chicken Kievs, chips, and maybe some peas or something else to go with them. So you can have them however you like. So let's chop into one and see what they're like, shall we? Oh yes, I'm looking for that beautiful garlic butter filling in the middle, and it's there. What I worry about sometimes is when I use the frozen ones, um, is that if they've got a hole in them somewhere, the garlic butter will come out, but these are absolutely spot on. And I can't wait to tuck into them and try them. So I had to dig into my chicken here. Mm. That's so, so nice. If you notice, I'm stealing the bit from the middle where it's got all the garlic butter on because I just love garlic butter. Mm. That's so nice. And chicken is so tender in the middle and it gets so so crispy from the bread in. One of my favourite things out of all the breaded chicken to cook in the air fry is the chicken Kiev because it just really does get crispy compared to some chickens where you have to spray them with olive oil to get the look. Thanks so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the Recipe This family. You can find us on Twitter, Facebook and Pinterest. We also have a weekly newsletter at recipethis.com forward slash newsletter where we share with you our latest kitchen gadget recipes, what we're cooking in the Milner kitchen and so much more. 
as well as this we recommend that you subscribe to our youtube channel and then whenever we have a new video you will be the first to know and if you want to know about all our future videos then i recommend you hit the bell for instant notifications but even better we now have a podcast it's called Magic with Gadgets. Simply search Magic with Gadgets on your favourite podcast player and you'll find us there. 